Hello there. Have you spent your first semester here at Mansfield and made the very wise decision to stick around? Well then, unless you plan on getting your degree by eating in Manzer, you are going to have to register for classes. But before you can do that, you'll need to find out when your scheduled date is. Does the simple thought of that confuse you? No fear. We are here to the rescue. Well, first, you will want to open your web browser and in your address bar type in mansfield.edu. If you haven't done this approximately 8 million times by now, I'm not sure we're going to be able to help you. Once you've reached the university website, you'll notice at the top right of the page there are several selections. Watch out for the giant eyes staring into your soul. Click on Quick Links, a black rectangular box with a short list of about uh, 500 items should appear. Ignore all of this, as I'm sure you usually do, and under the Web Logins category, choose Web Advisor. This selection will then subsequently redirect you to the Mansfield University Web Advisor. Do not fear, you haven't traveled back in time to 1985. This is where you will find your program evaluation. To utilize this website, you must first log in. To do so, you're going to need your user ID, which is the first part of your email, and everything proceeding at mounties.mansfield.edu. You will also need your password, which for first-time users will be the same as your user ID. Once you are logged in, you will see a screen with two selections, students and faculty. And unless you've become a professor after one semester of college, then you must click on the blue box indicating that you are a student. Once you access the student screen, you will notice that there are several selections. Under Academic Planning, select Program Evaluation. This will then lead you to a preliminary screen where you will select your active program by clicking the circle, then ignore the What if I changed my program study Dropbox and ensure that under the What work do you want to include Dropbox that the registered pre-registered is it visible, then click Submit. This will then lead you to your personal Mansfield University academic evaluation. Though this one looks very overwhelming and as if it was typed up in the 1800s, on a typewriter nonetheless, you only need to focus on one element for now. You will need to look at the program status in progress category and then look at your combined credits under credits earned. Write this number down on a piece of paper because if you're anything like me, you're probably going to forget. After you get this number, you will need to go back to your address bar and return to mansfield.edu. Back to the top right hand side of the page, to the far left of where you found the Quick Links tab, you will need to click on the A to Z. This will then take you to the A to Z index where you will need to click the R. Under the R category, you will need to click Registrar. This will then direct you to the Registrar page, where you will notice a black box to the far left of the page with several categories. Select Registration. This will then take you to a page, and under 2015 Spring, you will choose Registrar Schedule and Instructions. This document contains several important things to note while registering for classes. You may want to take a closer look at it at some other time. You will notice on the right hand side of this document, written in red, are several dates and numbers. Be sure to check to see if you qualify for early registration due to special circumstances. It's very important. If you do not qualify for special circumstances, you will need to reference the number of credit hours earned and match it with the corresponding date. This date is the day that you will be eligible, eligible to register for classes after you meet with your advisor. Thank you for watching. We hope that we've eased some of your registration anxieties. Now all you have to do is pass your classes, pay your tuition, register about uh, six more times, survive the weather, balance your social life and school, and keep appropriate hygiene. And you can earn your degree. Simple, right?